Hey everyone, Lewis aka Spider-Man991 here with another graphic novel review where today I'm going to be reviewing Camelot 3000. So basic, the basic plot is that it's the year 3000 and Earth is under attack from an alien invasion. While trying to escape from some alien soldiers, Tom, Tom Prentice uh, takes refuge underground and that eventually leads him to discovering the tomb of King Arthur and when he finds the tomb, he awakens he awakens Arthur and Arthur King Arthur basically returns to life. And Arthur's return is shortly followed by the return of Merlin, his sword Excalibur, and the reveal that Arthur's Knights of the Round Table have been reincarnated. So basic so once Arthur finds his reincarnated reincarnated knights, uh, together he forms New Camelot and they fight off the alien forces and eventually discover that the true masterminds behind the invasion are Morgan Le Fay and a reincarnated Mordred. I really like this series a lot. Uh, first off, it was basically DC Comics' first ever ma direct market title, as in the first title they ever sold exclusively at like, comic book shops. And it's also the first maxi series ever published by DC, which is great. Um, the series itself, the story itself, is a very interesting take take on the Arthur mythology because the legend of King Arthur it always ends with Arthur dying and saying that his body his body is put to rest and he will return one day when London when England needs him and of course alien invasion in the year 3000 obviously and it's uh, and I know it sounds weird hearing uh, the legend of King Arthur taking place in a future that is also a very science fiction environment but honestly uh, the story that might Mike Bark crafts in this uh, really makes it work. Uh, it doesn't feel like magic is overwhelming science fiction or vice versa. It feels very well balanced, which is nice. Um, there's also some very interesting things going on with the knights, uh, particularly uh, the character Sir Tristan, who when, who, when he is reincarnated, he's actually reincarnated as a woman. And there's a really interesting theme, go theme going on there. And also the artwork in this series is phenomenal. Um, it's by B Brian Boland, who you may know from The Killing Joke. And if you loved his artwork in The Killing Joke, then you will definitely love it in this series. In this series. Um, <clears throat> so basically, overall, if you enjoy the story of King Arthur, the uh, the series Merlin, what, whatever, if you just love the, the whole mythos behind King Arthur, then I highly recommend you should definitely check out Camelot 3000. Uh, that was pretty short. Uh, thank you again for watching. Uh, if you want to see my other graphic novel reviews, just click on my channel description. I've got a ton of other videos. Uh, if you want to see me review uh, future graphic novels, uh, stay subscribed and notified. I'm Spider-Man921 saying see you later.